hello guys welcome once again today I'm gonna show you how to use J progress bar like this this is your J progress bar so let's get started go to your J frame which is this take a J progress bar and you can see this is a blank bar so you can also change the properties here you can change the maximum value minimum value orientation vertical or horizontal tooltip text you know and in here if you go if you click string painted it will show what how much percentage of your progress bar is filled generally progress bar is used to show the percentage of your any data so it is used to represent 0 to 100 percent but it's not really restricted to 0 to 100 percent you can show any value from here minimum value or maximum value so, so you can set your value also so now I will tell you how to use it so for example if I enter some value in this text field for example 50 and press ok so our progress bar should be filled 50% so let's get started I will take a new button for this name it as progress ok and right click event action and action performed so I will go to my method and here you can write you have to write int whatever value you want to take so I will define the value name as value only and equal to int integer dot teacher dot parse int and here you take the name of your text field which is this so I right click and change variable name so this is my variable name value int so I have copy this variable name of my text field and put it inside parse int bracket dot get text ok then semicolon and second line whatever is your progress bar variable name is my variable name is j progress bar 1 of my progress bar so I copied it paste it here dot set value and ok and insert value in the bracket you have to insert this variable name which we have defined in the first line ok so now let's try to run the program 
so now when we enter here some value for example 50 and I press ok my progress bar is filled by 50% for example I will enter 10 so it should be filled by 10% and if I exceed its maximum limit which is 100 so for example I will fill 120 and press ok it will not go beyond 100% because I have already defined its maximum value as 100 so if you want to increase its maximum limit you have to go into the property and increase in its limit so you can do that also so this was the tutorial on how to use J progress bar I hope you have enjoyed this tutorial and please rate comment and subscribe and bye for now